This channel presents scientifically based rankings for life. Welcome everyone to today's lecture. I'm thrilled to see such a curious and engaged audience ready to dive into our topic. Revolutionary change. 5 secrets to a 180 degree life transformation. As we explore these secrets, remember, the key to transformative change lies not just in knowledge, but in its application. Let's begin. Number 5. Mindful Awareness. Mindful awareness, often referred to simply as mindfulness, is a mental state achieved by focusing one's awareness on the present moment. It involves acknowledging and accepting one's feelings, thoughts, and bodily sensations. It's a therapeutic technique rooted in meditation, which has garnered significant attention in psychology and neuroscience for its benefits on mental and physical health. The concept of mindfulness originates from Buddhist meditation practices, but in recent decades, it's been secularized and studied extensively in the scientific community. John Kabat-Zinn, the founder of the Mindfulness-Based Stress Reduction MBSR, program, defines mindfulness as the awareness that arises from paying attention, on purpose, in the present moment, non-judgmentally. This definition underscores mindfulness as a conscious effort to be present in every aspect of our lives. Let's talk about the brain. Research using MRI scans shows that mindfulness meditation can physically change the structure of the brain. A study by Sarah Lazar and her team at Harvard University found that mindfulness meditation can increase the thickness of the prefrontal cortex, the part of the brain associated with attention and executive functions like decision-making. Additionally, they observed decreased brain cell volume in the amygdala, which is responsible for fear, anxiety, and stress. These changes can lead to significant improvements in emotional regulation and stress response. Another critical aspect of mindfulness is its impact on attention. A study by Ja, Krompinger, and Bem in 2007 demonstrated that individuals who underwent mindfulness training showed significant improvements in attentional functions. They were better at focusing, had a greater attention span, and were more adept at switching between tasks. This is particularly relevant in our digital age, where attention is fragmented by a constant barrage of information and notifications. Mindfulness also plays a significant role in mental health. Numerous studies have shown its effectiveness in reducing symptoms of anxiety and depression. A meta-analysis of 39 studies, published in the journal JAMA Internal Medicine, found that mindfulness meditation programs had moderate evidence in reducing anxiety, depression, and pain. The beauty of mindfulness is that it teaches individuals to approach their thoughts and feelings without judgment, which can be particularly liberating for those struggling with negative self-talk and depressive thoughts. The benefits of mindfulness extend beyond mental health. It also has implications for physical health. For instance, mindfulness practices have been linked to lower blood pressure and improved immune response. A study published in the journal Psychosomatic Medicine found that HIV patients who practiced mindfulness meditation slowed down the reduction of their CD4 cell count, a type of white blood cell that's critical for fighting infection. Furthermore, mindfulness can enhance empathy and compassion, both towards oneself and others. A study by Condon, Daybords, Miller, and Desteno in 2013 found that participants who underwent mindfulness training were more likely to help someone in distress. This suggests that mindfulness not only benefits the individual practicing it but also the people around them. Implementing mindfulness in everyday life can be simple. It doesn't necessarily require sitting in meditation for hours. It can be as straightforward as paying full attention to your breath being aware of your sensory experiences while eating, or simply noticing the thoughts and feelings that arise during the day without getting lost in them. To conclude, the scientific evidence supporting the benefits of mindful awareness is compelling. It shows us that by regularly practicing mindfulness, we can change our brains in ways that improve our mental and physical health, enhance our attention and empathy, and reduce stress and anxiety. In this fast-paced, constantly connected world, embracing mindfulness can be a powerful tool for personal transformation and well-being. So, I encourage each of you to explore mindfulness, to be present in each moment, and to witness the profound impact it can have on your life.
Thank you for your attention, and let's continue to grow and learn together. Number 4. The Power of Habit Now, let's move on to the fourth secret of life transformation, the power of habit. Habits play an incredibly pivotal role in our lives. Much of what we do daily, from the moment we wake up to when we go to sleep, is governed by habits. Understanding and harnessing the power of habits can be a game-changer in personal transformation. The science of habit formation is fascinating. Habits are essentially the brain's way of saving energy. When a behavior becomes a habit, it moves from being controlled by the conscious, decision-making part of the brain, the prefrontal cortex, to the more automatic part, the basal ganglia. This shift allows us to perform many actions almost automatically, without expending much mental effort. Charles Duhigg, in his book, The Power of Habit, outlines what he calls the habit loop. This loop consists of three elements, cue, routine, and reward. The cue triggers the behavior, the routine is the behavior itself, and the reward is what we gain from the behavior. Understanding this loop is crucial to changing habits. Let's consider an example. Say you have a habit of eating a cookie every afternoon. The cue might be the time of day or a feeling of fatigue. The routine is eating the cookie, and the reward is the sugar rush or the momentary escape it provides. To change this habit, you need to identify the cue and the reward and then change the routine that occurs as a result of that cue to achieve a similar reward. The beauty of habit change lies in its compound effect. Small changes in habits can lead to significant transformations over time. A study published in the European Journal of Social Psychology found that on average, it takes more than two months before a new behavior becomes automatic, 66 days to be exact. This finding highlights the importance of patience and persistence in habit formation. Moreover, habits also play a critical role in our mental health. A study in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology found that people with more self-control, which is often a product of good habits, are happier over both the short-term and long-term. This is partly because good habits help us avoid the stress and guilt that come with poor decision-making. A critical aspect of changing habits is self-awareness. You need to be aware of your actions and the triggers that lead to those actions. Journaling can be an effective tool in increasing this awareness. By noting down when and why you engage in a particular habit, you can begin to see patterns and identify the cues and rewards driving your behavior. Building new habits also involves creating an environment that supports them. For example, if you want to build a habit of reading every night, you might place a book on your bedside table. Or, if you're trying to eat healthier, you might start by stocking your fridge with healthy snacks. In addition to changing individual habits, it's also important to understand the power of keystone habits. These are habits that can trigger widespread change in our lives. For instance, regular exercise is a keystone habit that tends to lead to better eating habits, improved productivity, and better mood regulation. In conclusion, understanding and mastering the power of habit can be a transformative force in our lives. It's about recognizing the patterns we follow unconsciously, dissecting them, and then reconstructing them in ways that serve us better. Remember, the journey to transforming your life through habits doesn't happen overnight. It requires dedication, awareness, and sometimes a bit of trial and error. But the results, a happier, healthier, and more productive life, are well worth the effort. Thank you, and let's keep building those positive habits together. Number 3. Lifelong Learning Let's delve into the third key element of life transformation. Lifelong Learning Lifelong learning is the continuous pursuit of personal and professional development, and it's a crucial component of a transformative life. In today's rapidly changing world, the ability to adapt and learn new skills is not just valuable, it's essential. The concept of neuroplasticity lies at the heart of lifelong learning. Neuroplasticity refers to the brain's ability to reorganize itself by forming new neural connections throughout life. This ability contradicts the old belief that the brain's structure is fixed and unchangeable after a certain age. Research in neuroscience has shown that our brains remain malleable well into adulthood, meaning we can continue to learn and grow mentally as we age. Let's consider the impact of lifelong learning on our cognitive abilities. 
A study published in the journal Psychological Science found that learning complex skills like digital photography or quilting enhanced memory function in older adults. This finding is significant because it demonstrates that engaging in new learning experiences can have a protective effect on the brain, potentially staving off cognitive decline. Moreover, lifelong learning is not just about acquiring new skills or knowledge, it's also about fostering a mindset of curiosity and openness to new experiences. This mindset can lead to greater creativity and innovation. Steve Jobs himself famously attributed his creativity to his wide range of experiences and his ability to connect the dots between seemingly unrelated things. In the context of professional development, the importance of lifelong learning cannot be overstated. With the advent of artificial intelligence, automation, and rapidly evolving industries, the half-life of skills is shrinking. This means that skills that are valuable today may become obsolete tomorrow. Therefore, continuous learning is crucial for maintaining and enhancing employability. Embracing lifelong learning also has psychological benefits. It can lead to increased self-efficacy, the belief in our ability to succeed in specific situations. This belief is critical for overcoming challenges and achieving goals. Furthermore, learning new skills can be incredibly fulfilling and can contribute to a sense of purpose and well-being. But how do we foster lifelong learning? First, it's about creating a personal culture of growth and curiosity. This might involve setting aside time for reading, taking online courses, attending workshops or lectures, or simply being open to new experiences and ideas. Another important aspect is learning how to learn effectively. This involves understanding your learning style, whether it's visual, auditory, reading and writing, or kinesthetic, and applying learning techniques that align with your style. It also involves critical thinking and the ability to question and analyze information critically. Lifelong learning also benefits from a supportive community or network. Engaging with peers, mentors, or learning groups can enhance the learning experience, providing motivation, feedback, and different perspectives. In conclusion, lifelong learning is a critical component of personal and professional transformation. It's about continuously expanding our horizons, challenging ourselves, and adapting to the ever-changing world around us. By embracing a mindset of lifelong learning, we open ourselves up to endless possibilities for growth and fulfillment. Thank you, and let's keep learning and growing together. Number 2. Emotional Intelligence Let's explore the second key element of transformative change, emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence, often abbreviated as EQ, refers to the ability to recognize, understand, manage, and reason with emotions, both in ourselves and others. This concept, popularized by psychologist Daniel Goleman, has revolutionized the way we think about success and leadership. At its core, emotional intelligence comprises four main skills, self-awareness, self-management, social awareness, and relationship management. 1. Self-awareness is about understanding your own emotions, strengths, weaknesses, values, and motives. People high in self-awareness are honest with themselves and others, and they operate with a clear understanding of who they are. A study in the journal Frontiers in Psychology found that self-awareness is crucial for various aspects of well-being, including life satisfaction and emotional balance. 2. Self-management involves controlling one's emotions and impulses and adapting to changing circumstances. This skill is critical for staying focused and productive, even in the face of challenges. According to research in the Journal of Vocational Behavior, employees with high self-management abilities are more likely to experience job satisfaction and career success. 3. Social awareness is about understanding the emotions, needs, and concerns of other people, picking up on emotional cues, and recognizing the power dynamics in a group or organization. This skill is essential for empathy, which is a key component of effective leadership. A study published in the journal Cognition and Emotion showed that empathy is linked to increased helping behavior and social cooperation. 4. Relationship management, the fourth skill, involves the ability to inspire, influence, and develop others while managing conflict. This skill is crucial in leadership positions, 
as it helps in nurturing relationships that can help both individuals and organizations thrive. Research in the Journal of Organizational Behavior highlights that leaders with high emotional intelligence are better able to foster a positive work environment and facilitate a collaborative team culture. The importance of emotional intelligence extends beyond the workplace. In personal relationships, EQ can lead to more satisfying and deeper connections. For instance, a study in the Journal of Family Psychology found that emotional intelligence is positively associated with marital satisfaction. Developing emotional intelligence starts with introspection and mindfulness. By paying attention to our own emotional responses and learning to understand their sources, we can begin to manage our emotions more effectively. Additionally, actively seeking feedback from others can provide valuable insights into our emotional strengths and weaknesses. Another important aspect is empathy, which involves not only understanding others' emotions but also responding to them appropriately. This might involve active listening, validating others' feelings, or simply being present and attentive. In conclusion, emotional intelligence is a powerful tool for personal and professional transformation. It enables better self-regulation, enhances relationships, and improves leadership abilities. By developing our emotional intelligence, we can create a more fulfilling life and positively impact those around us. Thank you, and let's continue to nurture our emotional intelligence together. Number 1. Purpose and Vision Let's delve into the most crucial aspect of life transformation, purpose and vision. Purpose and vision are at the very heart of personal transformation. They are about understanding your why, the reason you do what you do, the core values that guide your life, and the vision you have for your future. This clarity of purpose and vision is what gives direction and meaning to our actions, leading to profound and lasting change. 1. Understanding your purpose. This is about more than just setting goals. It's about understanding what truly matters to you, what you're passionate about, and what gives your life meaning. A study in the Journal of Positive Psychology found that individuals who have a sense of purpose report higher levels of satisfaction and well-being. Purpose acts as a compass that helps navigate through life's challenges and decisions, keeping you aligned with your core values and goals. 2. Creating a vision for your life. Vision is about picturing your ideal future. Where do you see yourself in 5, 10, or 20 years? What kind of life do you want to lead? What impact do you want to have? Vision provides a roadmap for your journey. Research in the field of positive psychology shows that having a clear and compelling vision can motivate us, guide our decisions, and help us to overcome obstacles. 3. The power of goal setting. Aligning your daily actions with your broader purpose and vision is crucial. This alignment is achieved through setting and pursuing goals. A study in the American Journal of Health Promotion found that goal setting is an effective tool for behavior change. Goals give you a target to aim for, a way to measure progress, and a sense of accomplishment as you achieve them. 4. Resilience and Adaptability Maintaining purpose and vision requires resilience and adaptability. Life is unpredictable, and challenges will arise. The ability to stay committed to your vision, even when faced with obstacles, is key to transformation. Research in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology indicates that resilience can be developed through practices like positive thinking, emotional regulation, and cultivating supportive relationships. 5. Living your values. Your values are the principles that guide your behavior and decision-making. Aligning your life with these values is essential for a fulfilling and authentic life. This means making choices that reflect what you believe in, even when it's difficult. Studies in social psychology have shown that living in accordance with one's values is associated with higher levels of happiness and lower levels of stress. 6. Inspiring others with your vision. When you have a clear purpose and vision, you not only transform your own life but also inspire those around you. Leadership research consistently shows that the most inspiring and influential leaders are those with a clear vision and the ability to communicate it effectively. In summary, purpose and vision are not just about reaching a destination. They're about the journey itself. A journey of understanding who you are, what you value, and what you aspire to achieve. 
This journey requires introspection, commitment, and action. It's about making choices every day that move you closer to your ideal future. When you live with purpose and vision, you live a life of meaning and impact. Thank you, and let's each strive to live a life aligned with our deepest purposes and visions. Conclusion Transforming your life 180 degrees is not a quick fix, but a journey. A journey that involves mindfulness, reshaping habits, continuous learning, emotional intelligence, and a strong sense of purpose. Remember, the path of transformation is ongoing, and every step you take is a step towards a more fulfilling life. Keep learning, keep growing, and thank you for your attention and enthusiasm today. Let's go out there and make a change. Thanks for watching. See you again.